So as some of you may know, the uh, new Glen Rocket has uh, made the journey from its uh, production factory over 20 miles um, to the launch pad um, at the Kennedy Space Center. So they're actually going to light this firecracker and launch it for its first inaugural uh, space flight. Uh, the new Glenn rocket, its flight profile looks just like this. Um, it will take off from the launch pad as we just you know, saw it sitting there. And they will actually attempt to land it on a uh, seafaring uh, drone ship, uh, similar to how SpaceX does uh, with their Falcon 9 rockets. So this would, if they're successful, this would only be the second company or government agency or what have you to actually accomplish this. And then, um, of course, the second stage um, uh, will be uh, going uh, at orbital velocities uh, with a test payload. And the uh, second stage uh, booster uh, will uh, drop off into the ocean, uh, basically just as the um, uh, second stage does currently with the Falcon 9 as well. Can you believe NASA just released this pretty awesome fireplace rocket ship thing for Christmas? They just uh, posted it on their channel. It's eight hours long, so uh, you can keep cozy during the holidays. Um, anyhow, the link's in the description. So wishing Godspeed to the Blue Origin team and a shout out to our guy Jeff Bezos for uh, personally funding it, making it happen. I mean, uh, space competition is fantastic. And when they announce the uh, launch date, um, We'll do a quick little update and follow along and um, see how they uh, how they fare. But again, late November of this year, 2024, is the first proposed uh, launch date. It might slip to early December, but from uh, everything we've seen so far, they look like they're ready to go. So stay tuned.